Welcome to IPOB Rapture Media. IPOB press release the 10th of June, 2024. Southeast governors should cancel all power contracts with EEDC. The global family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, ably led by the great and indefatigable leader, Mazi Namdi Okwu Kanu, calls on the governors in the Southeast to cancel all power contracts with Enugu Electricity Distribution Company, EEDC, for being an impediment to the development of the region. EEDC has proven to be incapable of providing reliable, adequate, and affordable electricity to support economic stimulation and growth of the Southeast. The company is just extorting money from the people of the Southeast without providing reliable electricity. The Southeast governors should leverage the electricity deregulation policy of Tinubu's government and engage other local or foreign electricity generation and distribution companies to take the place of the incompetent company called EEDC. The current electricity deregulation policy of the federal government of Nigeria has given powers to the state government to generate and distribute power to their state. Therefore, Southeast governors must not subject the eastern region to darkness in order to please the insatiably greedy company called EEDC and its owner. Electricity is a catalyst for economic development and growth, which Indigbo must not be denied at a time like this. Southeast governors have no excuse for not providing reliable and efficient electricity in their states. The time of giving excuses with the monopoly of NEPA, PHCN, or EEDC is over. Now the federal government electricity deregulation has given them the power to hire and fire any electricity company in their state. Eastern region governors can come together and partner with a reputable power company that can provide steady and affordable electricity for the entire region. The governors must ensure that there is adequate electricity in the region without further delay. Our attention has been drawn to the unconfirmed letter written to the Southeast governors, universities, institutions, companies, and communities by EEDC to these people and groups mentioned above to come and pay what they did not consume, and failure to do so EEDC will shut off their lights. We beg EEDC to jettison such idea because we don't want to use force on them, and if they want to test the power IPOB possesses, we will let them taste the venom. If they venture to cut any lights in the southeast this time around, we will react because we have endured enough. The citizens of the southeast are charged to deal with anyone seen as EEDC representatives anywhere in our land who try to shut off people's lights. They must be lynched and they must call any IPOB office close to you with the information. EEDC is a big disappointment to the people of the Southeast region. They are not showing any sign of repentance or improvement in the electricity distribution, and they failed to provide prepaid meters across the Southeast region. Their extortion and incompetency should not be endured any longer. IPOB wants the governors not to allow EEDC to use another company to come back and deceive them, and try to take another contract because EEDC has failed and cannot handle the electricity distribution in the Southeast region. Period. IPOB wants the governors to take responsibility for providing steady light in the southeast region. The development and progress of the southeast is dependent on these conditions. They should stop every unnecessary excuse. IPOB and Indigbo in general have lost confidence in EEDC. Our people must be prepared to chase EEDC out of the region. IPOB is not backing down on plans of ejecting the rogue company called EEDC from the region. The southeastern governors must wake up and demonstrate their willingness to drive economic development of the East via the provision of steady and affordable electricity by cancelling all power deals with incompetent and extortionist Inugu Electricity Distribution Company, EEDC, Comrade Emma Powerful, Media and Publicity Secretary for IPOB. Please don't forget to support the ESN at www.ipob.org.